Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So for today's video, we have a comic book unboxing from a local comic book store called The Comic Book Shop. And uh, yeah, we're gonna open this up, see what I got. Pretty excited. Uh, so yeah, there's a local comic book store in Ottawa, Ontario, Canada. And it's called The Comic Book Shop. Shop's spelled with two P's and an E on the end. I'll link everything down below. That way you guys can check them out if you want. Uh, but yeah, they have very good selection. Excellent packaging, as you can tell. There's a book right there. But uh, yeah, we're gonna open this up and uh, show you what I got. There's the business card. It says the comic book shop. Uh, very cool. Love that mascot logo. Really cool. So uh, yeah, we're gonna just put that there. We'll quickly go through them one by one. I believe they're also in another big bag here. So, I'm going to quickly open this up. Yeah, they definitely know how to package. Holy moly. That's really cool. Alright, so there's five books. One, two, uh, three, four, five. Six. Did I order six? I guess six. I don't remember. I thought it was five. Alright, so we're going to start off with this one. And it is X Men issue 266. Uh, this is from uh, the first appearance of Gambit. Very excited. Uh, as you can see, it says $3.99 there. So it is a facsimile. Uh, it's not the actual real comic. But it's still really cool. That is really neat to have. Uh, but yeah. Very excited to have it that way uh, I can actually read the story and not spend like, I don't know, over $100 over for a copy. So, yeah, very excited to have this. That was really sweet. I like that it includes all the old ads and everything too. And uh, yeah, so next one upside down, and it is Bosses the Scarlet Witch. Uh, this is a variant cover, Alex Ross. Very, very cool. It is a uh, for Strange Academy, I don't remember which issue now. I think number four. Not too sure, but I'm pretty sure. But uh, yeah, it's really cool. Uh, I have this one now. And I also have Daredevil, which was for issue number 23, I think. But yeah, guys, I'm pretty excited to have this one. It's really, really cool. Uh, I only have this one and the Daredevil one. And uh, yeah, I was going to get the Spider-Man one too, but I didn't really like the, I don't know, the pose. It looks like he was like trying to lift up something very heavy. And it looked really weird to me, but uh, yeah, I'm very excited to have that one. She looks really cool on the cover there. All right, next one we have is Scream. Uh, Scream number one, Curse of Carnage, and uh, this is an art germ uh, variant cover, which is the only reason why I bought it, is because I know in Concories, uh sometimes they have uh, a category of an art germ cover. And I'm hoping to play that game one of these days. And when I do, I'll have at least some one art term cover to use. And uh, yeah, so when I do play that game, this is the one I'm going to be using. And uh, yeah, it's just really cool looking too. I love that a lot. I love the colors. They're so like vibrant and popping out and stuff. It's really cool. Uh, but yeah, my very first art term cover. All right, so three more to go. And it is Avengers number 57. Another facsimile, and it is the first appearance of Vision. Very cool cover right there. That's awesome. And uh, yeah, I'm not too sure who did this cover, but it looks really awesome. Uh, but yeah, let me know in the comments if you know if uh, you know who did this cover, because that is really cool. Uh, but yeah, I got like Hawkeye, I think that's Ant Man, and uh, Black Panther maybe, or Daredevil. Very hard to see, but uh, yeah, there you go. There, really cool. Very happy to have that and uh, need a copy too. So yeah, there's two more. That one's facing up, so I know what that one is. And uh, yeah, so this one is mystery. It is. Oh, this is haha. Haha -ha by Image Comics issue number one. This is the first printing as well. And uh, yeah, I thought for sure there'd be like upcharging or something for it. But uh, yeah, paying cover price for it, which is really cool. First printing and uh, yeah, uh, it's supposed to be like one shots pretty much. And uh, yeah, I'm very excited to have issue number one. And it's by the same guy, Prince Del Rey, who also does Ice Cream Man. 
It's also like another like one shot series. It's not really connected at all apparently. I don't know. I haven't read it, but that's what um, Bueller from Comics with Bueller says. Is that like it's just all one shots? And uh, yeah, very excited to have this cover. Didn't have to get like a second printing, but uh, yeah, very excited to have it and uh, continue on that series because I totally missed out on Ice Cream Man and that's way up there now. I think that's on like issue 25 or something. And uh, yeah, last one is New Mutants 90, 98. And uh, yeah, uh, this is the first appearance of uh, Deadpool. I'm uh, very excited to get it because if you want this comic in like the original form, that's going to be like a couple hundred dollars. So pretty excited to just get it for $3.99 and it comes with all the original ads and everything which is really awesome and just like a perfect reader copy or nice display piece, you know? So very excited to have it. It was really, really cool. And uh, yeah, I know uh, Rob Liefeld gets like a lot of slack or a lot of flack, I mean, because like he doesn't draw very well, <laughs> but it's, uh, uh, yeah, like his legs are very, very skinny. It looks kind of weird. But uh, yeah, there is some damage on this book I didn't really notice, but uh, yeah, there's some like coffee stains or something in here, and a little bit up on the corner there on the, on the board, but uh, not too bad as a reader copy like I was saying, and uh, it's not like it's going to CGC or anything like that. But uh, yeah, very excited to have all six of those books, I thought for sure there's five, but uh, yeah, there's six. So let me know in the comments if... Uh, you have any of these books in your collection or uh, what your favorite is that I picked up today. Was it New Mutants 98? Was it uh, Ha Ha issue number one? Was it Avengers number 57? That is really cool with that cover. I gotta find out who did it because yeah, that's really awesome. Scream, Curse of Carnage, Heart Germ cover. Only reason why I bought it. But uh, yeah, that is cool. And uh, yeah, Scarlet Witch cover, Alex Ross, Pretty sure there's a Strange Academy number four, issue number four, and uh, Uncanny X-Men uh, 266, uh, first appearance of Gambit. Really, really cool. Enter the Mutant, mutant Colin Gambit. Really, really cool. Love that a lot. But uh, yeah, my favorite would probably be, I don't know, that's rough. I don't know, <laughs> that's a tough one. Uh, my favorite would probably be that Avengers cover. That is really sweet. Love it a lot. And uh, yeah, very, very excited that I just I paid cover price for it. I didn't have to find like a really expensive one like on eBay or anything like that. Very happy to just pay cover price and uh, shipping, which is really great. So yeah, very excited to have this in my collection right here. And uh, yeah, guys, thanks so much for watching. I will link all the information down below if you want to check out the comic book shop. Big shout out to them for... Uh, helping me get these books and uh, yeah guys thanks so much for watching see you guys in the next video